So I kind of love string theory and I always thought it would be the theory to win. But in looking at it more, the one thing I don't like about it is I always say it's 11 dimensional for it to work and that's true and I never really thought about the breakdown of those dimensions. 10 of those dimensions are directional dimensions, which is normal. The thing I don't like is the 11th dimension is time. I think that's, I think that's a knock against string theory. And the reason is for all the reasons I've talked about in past videos where time isn't even a real thing. Time kind of emerges. So if time is, if time is like a variable for the 11th dimensional beings that created this place we live in, you know, that doesn't make sense to me. That, that being or force should be out of time. It shouldn't, it shouldn't be affected by time in the 11th dimension, in my opinion. The way I envision this, it shouldn't, it should be out of time. And again, that's for all the reasons we've talked about, like, you know, the speed of light is a patch, the speed of light. If you go as fast as it, time stands still. There's all this evidence time emerges just from relative motion of objects. That shouldn't be a concept for a creator of this place and an 11th dimensional being that has the power to create this place. That type of being should be out of time. So it makes me a little bit negative about string theory. So I feel like something is wrong with string theory if it has time as a variable.